guys so welcome back to my channel so in today's video I'm going to share something with you guys which I've been testing out for nearly a month now and um, and I notice it's actually one of the best things I ever discovered so I'm just gonna go through um, the whole uh, product and why I'm liking it and why it's so good and all the other stuff so also i'm not 100 percent sure if i'm just going to um put the whole look uh, in this video or not but if you want to see how i created this look just leave it in the comment section below and i will upload that video separately so let's just go ahead and i'm just going to talk to you guys about to you guys about um the my current favorite uh, foundation uh, especially for winter weather um I have been testing a lot of foundations from past month the thing is that the main thing is the foundations which goes really nicely during the summer it might not be appropriate to use during the winter unless you use a lot of oils like face oils and like dry cream like uh, extra dry um, skin creams and like this kind of skin food kind of creams then it's a different story but if you just want to put a foundation without doing all the extra steps or without adding all the extra products then this foundation is a must-have for winter season so coming back to this foundation I actually started using this in the summer and I, the shade I have right now it was very good for summer because you tend to go out you get, tend to get a little tan and all that but for winter it's slightly darker for my skin tone but because I like to do well I started doing self tanning from past like a month and a half or so and I kind of getting more fond of self tanning of that look even though I'm not doing as much I've only done it like once or twice so far but I just like the effect if I want I can match my body with the same shade so the foundation I'm going to talk to you guys about is from Wonder Beauty I have used this in my many 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 previous videos and you all know by now if you're following me for a long time this is one of my like favorite foundations I literally fell in love with this foundation because you only need a very small amount it is a super full coverage foundation and you can build the coverage to your liking you can either do a very um, like medium layer uh, like a thin layer and then just go with a more natural look or if you want to give uh, extra coverage you can just build the coverage as you want so this particular foundation was my favorite during the summer but the only thing i noticed was if i don't set this properly i t i was i was getting a little bit sweaty around my upper lips those are the areas i actually suffer anyway whenever I, it's hot weather like i get a sweat sweater like a sweat mark on my upper lips on my right like in between my chin like right here in the crease or sometimes my forehead gets a little oily kind of thing so for summer i have to really set this foundation like really really well for it to stay like totally like stick onto my face and not move don't budge anything like that but for but for winter weather this foundation has been my favorite i think in last month or so like beginning since beginning of november every time i'm doing my makeup I'm just keep picking up the same foundation because I'm just loving the kind of effect, the kind of glow, the kind of dewiness, the radiant it just gives me. So you know, I am a very like I'm very very dry skin person, and I have very sensitive skin too. I tend to use um, I am a lot into skincare, so I tend to use a lot of skincare on my face, which is related to like more dry skin, more hydration, more brightening, more like moisturizing and stuff like that. So I do, and I tend to use a lot of Korean skincare brands. So when I like last month when i sat down one day and i was just doing my makeup i just thought okay let me try this i was trying this in summer i was loving it anyway and i just not really sure how it's going to go on in the winter so i put it on the only thing i did was extra was i actually did edit some for sally uh, rose gold uh, 24 karat gold infused beauty oil drops but i do use the 
like face oils in during the winter season in my skincare routine anyway so it wasn't like it was kind of like an extra step i was just doing a little i was just adding a few drops giving my skin a little bit more hydration and moisture before going with my foundation and i will put the picture like post a video down here or somewhere here to show you before, when I like when I started doing this look today, how my skin was looking and how much of it looked differently after applying this foundation. So it just literally gives my skin a super 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 full coverage, like without doing a lot of steps. And my skin looks so dewy, so radiant, and it looks like I have no issues of dryness. And if the makeup stays on exactly like this throughout the whole day, which was always my like concern if it's gonna stay on or not, if it's gonna budge, do I have to set during the day? No. Once I finish with my makeup, I'm done for a whole day. I'm good for a whole day. I don't need to do anything. So about this foundation, the few things you need to know is Again, I will put the um, screenshot in between the video or the next shot to show you. It's a full coverage foundation. It is for skin type, it's for natural, dry and combination. Now, I would really recommend this for oily skin because it is a bit of a, like, um, because it's an illusion, kind of like a luminous kind of foundation. If your skin is oily and you apply this, you might even go, like, you might will have some sort of problem with your face or your makeup your certain part of your face might go really oily and everything because it's just the way this foundation is it's not meant to be for oily skin i don't know if you just use it and set it with the powder like a lot of powder then it's a different story but if you are oily skin i won't recommend this to you they have so many shades so many shades in the range so you definitely it doesn't matter what skin type you are what skin what uh, um, like what like um, skin color you are you can always find your shade close to your own skin tone i recently just purchased another one this is one of the <laughs> this is apart from the clinique one this is probably the second foundation which i completely ran out of it and i actually have to purchase another one because usually i have so like i have so many foundations and only few which are my favorites and then i tend to like use them more often and i just completely like forget about some of the, the one i tried or something but I just stick, I don't know, I'm like a person of habit. If I get used to some doing something or using something, I always tend to go back for the same item. But this is really, really good. So if you are in the market right now and you are a very dry skin person, you might want to check out this particular brand. They are absolutely amazing, um, very affordable as well. For I think the foundation is 53 Canadian dollars. That's without the GST, PST, and it's available to purchase from Sephora. So, 53 dollar for a bit, and I bought this in summer. So maybe like in June or July, and I'm already end of the year. I still have quite a bit left, but because I'm I get like a little apprehensive when my, my favorite product is about to run out. So I already got the backup. So, but it's seriously one of the best foundations for winter weather, especially if you're a dry skin and you're looking for a radiant dewy finish as your makeup base. So do check them out. They are super duper, super duper good. Um, I will put all the information about the, uh, all the, pro like all the, uh, ingredients in this uh, foundation in the description box below so if you want to do your search go ahead and do it but I can highly recommend you that you won't be disappointed if you get this foundation because it's so good it's definitely going to work in the summer as well and in the winter but for me for winter weather this is a super duper hit so hope you find this quick review helpful and hope you will be trying this out if you do try this out let me know what you think i will like i would love to know what your uh, thoughts were what were your first impression was and if you think there is a better one in the market leave them in the comment section below and i just want to say thank you so much guys for keep supporting me 
I'm really really grateful for all your love support you give me every time I post a video it's really nice to see you guys are finding my content helpful and you're finding it um, easy to like understand me and all that sometimes I get a little flustered but hey ho I'm only a human <laughs> so once again thank you so much for watching and i will see you guys next time very very soon love you guys take care bye